I need to start doing yoga in the morning or something because like I feel super tight. Also, do you love this shirt? Because I made this like two years ago, three years ago. Goodness gracious, I guess it's been three years already. I made this as my wedding dress prototype. I was trying out different tops and I this is like prototype number 72 or something. I don't even know. But uh, I turned it into a shirt instead. <laughs> There's like more detailing like you can see. Anyways. Guess what time of the month it is. That's guess. Yeah, it's it's the romance reveal box time. I love these boxes. You guys know I love these boxes. They're very fun for me every single time. If you love a good romance book, if you love indie authors who write romance books, this is like the perfect subscription box for you. They have different tiers. You can just get the book, like just one book and that's it. And that's very reasonably priced. Or you can get two books with swag or three books or four books or five books or six books every month. And it's like so good. Like it's so amazing. So I have February's and I'm very excited because February is like one of my favorite months in the world. So that's a weird way to say that. Let's open it. So as we open this up, I already pre-cut it. Ta-da! The sticker says, thank you for supporting our small business made with love. Oh, I can already smell the candle. It smells so good. I'm very excited because when you first open it up, this is what we get. I can already see some very fun things on the top here. For instance, are these socks? I believe these are socks. fuzzy gray socks and they have the little I thought these were stickers but they're not they're part of the sock but this is nice they look super comfy and soft and cozy immediately yes immediately the rest of the box we don't need to we don't care I love airheads I love airheads you guys know I have such a sweet tooth I love sweethearts and I love airheads so good so excited what is this I think this is chapstick. It does not smell like anything. We have this, it's called Pucker Up. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. It's called Pucker Up Book Lover. And it's like a little chapstick. Isn't that so cute? I love that. Oh, this is a luggage. It's like one of those luggage thingies for your luggage, which is perfect because I am planning on some traveling this year. And this one says love books. And then you can put like your information on the back here. So that's nice. Look, so cute. I think this might be a sticker. A little sticker right here. A little bookmark. Cute, cute. I love a good bookmark. What else do we have in here? The pen. You all know I love their pens. This one says proud romance reader. I love their pens. I keep them a little jar back here. I love their pens. They write so well. I don't know who's in charge of the pens, but whoever it is does such a good job getting the pens. They're, it's just every single time the pen is top notch. I would like to shake the hand of whoever does those advertisement type of thing. And then we have the candle, always. This candle is berries and twigs. Very interesting. I can't open this. How do you open? There we go. Ah! Ah! Oh, that smells really good. It kind of smells like Christmas, but it smells very good. I love the tea light candles as well. They're one of my faves. And now let's get into the books. I'm already very excited about the books. So I'll show you both of the books actually. Hold on, let me show you. These are the books. And uh, I'm excited about this one because I just, how to ruin a wedding, already we're off to a good start. There are three things to know about Tilly Mahoney. One, she's a liar. 
Two, she thinks she's in love with her best friend. Three, she's got a plan to ruin his wedding. Tilly and her best friend have been through it all for decades. He has been her support system and she's been his right hand gal. And now he's engaged to someone else. Not on her watch. Hey, wanna help me break up a wedding? Is a dubious start to an unlikely friendship, but the bride's ex-boyfriend, Zach, is the perfect partner in crime for Tilly's misguided plan to spoil the nuptials. The bearded and brooding man is clearly desperate to win back the love of his life, and she's all too willing to help if it'll break up the happy couple. But the more she tries to interfere with the wedding and the closer she gets to Zach, the more confusing Tilly's feelings become about a decades long friendship, about the way she thought, about what she thought was love, and most terrifyingly, about the way Zach saves all of his smiles for her. This immediately, yes, immediately, I'm excited about this. This sounds so good. I'm excited and of course it is signed by the author as they all are every single month. This sounds so good. I love, first of all, I just love the premise. I love everything about this. I love grumpy people in general. So I'm very excited about this book. And then the next book is called Accepting Fate. Oh, and this is book one. Faded to You, book one. Oh, <gasps> Faded to You is a soulmate. What is the other one? like faded mates is this a mate book <gasps> is this a, is this like a paranormal supernatural <gasps> let's find out my 18th birthday was supposed oh it says logan my 18th birthday was supposed to be the happiest day of my life but quickly turned into a day i'll never forget i ran away from everything i knew and never looked back i never let anyone close enough in case my demons hiding in the shadows decided to make a move until i met him he came into my life as if he were a shining light in my world full of darkness i knew the moment i looked into his midnight blue eyes that he was the one i had been looking for to help me out of the shadows i tried to push him away but we were inevitable i just had to accept that fate would allow me to feel his love forever but unfortunately for me fate isn't always on my side eight years after that tragic day everything i'd been running from finally caught up to me and then Grayson, when I met her, I saw something familiar. We both harbored secrets that turned into demons. She feared what lurked in the shadows and I harbored the loss of the ones I pushed into them. Without realizing it, she helped me out of a place that was so dark, I never thought I'd see the light again. I never thought I would find someone that would accept me and the weight of the ones I've lost. Until one day, the demon surfaced and threatened to take it all away. I made a promise to her that I would keep her safe and I will stop at nothing to keep that promise. Are there vampires? I just want to know. Are there? <gasps> oh, there's a note to the reader. A note to the reader. It does not say anything about werewolves or vampires. But look, it is signed. We love a good signed book. I'm excited about this. This sounds fun. I, yeah. Both of these books sound very fun and very up my alley, so we're excited about that. Good things happening all around. I love the romance reveal box and I totally stand by it. I think it's amazing. I think it's a good box and I think it is worth your money. I am going to see, is this pigmented? No, it's just chapstick. Hmm, it's very, I don't know how to say this, but it's very chapsticky. Like it's, it feels almost like just putting some Vaseline on your lips. Like it feels like, like it's winter time right now. And today it was probably 28 degrees Fahrenheit, maybe negative one Celsius. And my lips are always chapped in the winter time. And like just putting this on, I'm not, this is not sponsored. None of these videos are ever sponsored. I've never got a sponsorship. Like I've not had one sponsored video ever in my life. But this chapstick, actually, it feels nice on my lips. <laughs> Gonna be honest here. I wonder what the brand is because it really feels good. I don't know what any of these things are saying on the ingredients list, but there is no brand attached to this. It might just be like one of those like no brand things type of thing, but uh, maybe get yourself a romance reveal box and you'll get a nice chapstick too that uh, fixes your chapped lips, who knows? I have other subscription boxes and I was wondering if you guys would want me to put all of my subscription boxes in like one video. Cause I also do like the book of the month 
And I don't know if you would be interested in seeing like the books that I also get from Book of the Month. I think the Romance Reveal box is so fun because you see like all of the the goodies that happen in the box as well and I think that's fun and makes the video fun but if you would be interested in seeing like all the books that I got every month then you know just let me know in the comments down below and I will absolutely why did I say it like that <laughs> absolutely I will do that for you so yeah just uh just just let me no don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like the video do all the things for youtube it's crazy to me because right now i am getting very close to 200 subscribers i know that's not like a huge like it's kind of silly but i don't know it's just like it's really cool that people also love books and want to hear me talk about books that I'm reading and I just I love talking about books and I love book subscription boxes and all that kind of stuff so it's just really cool for me to see all of you guys who are subscribed and supporting and like commenting and all that stuff it just makes me really happy so I really appreciate that I just want to say thank you again it's not like a huge milestone or anything like that like I get that it's it's really nothing compared to like some other booktubers but it means a lot to me and you know it's just i don't know it, it means a lot to me it means a lot that you guys enjoy my silly little videos like it means a lot to me and um it's just something that i wanted to say so that's that's really that's all the cheesiness that i have for now i am actually gonna let you go though because i'm very tired and I really wanted to read this one book that I'm reading right now because it's actually really, really good. So I'm gonna go lay in bed and do a little bit of reading and then go to sleep. So I will see you guys in the next video. I have a really fun video planned for next video that should be coming out. I believe this is gonna come out on a Saturday. If I, if I do my math right, this video will come out before the next video, so yeah. Anyways, I'm just excited. I'm very happy. Um, and uh, it's thanks to you guys. So have a great rest of your night, day, wherever you are. And I will see you in the next one. Okay, goodbye.